What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to install faux wood window blinds. In most cases you need a few simple tools including a tape measure, drill bits, Phillips screwdriver, a drill, and a pencil. First thing you want to do is take everything out of the package. This includes the blinds, the front valance, the hardware, and there should be a checklist that comes in the instructions. Once you know you have everything, it's time to get started. Start by taking out the two left and right brackets from the packaging and the hardware that's located inside there. It's a little bit hard to see, but this is the left hand bracket and this is the right hand bracket. They both are stamped on the inside of the bracket itself. Before you start, you'll just want to double check that you measure correctly by holding the blinds themselves up. The total gap on both sides combined should be no more than an inch and a half. In my case, I have just over an inch, so I'm going to want to split the difference going forward. So starting on the left side, I'm going to line up the bracket about a half inch in from the side there. Make sure it's straight, front to back, left to right, and then you're going to want to draw the holes for your drill. Using a 1 16th inch drill bit, you're going to want to drill these two holes out to a depth of about one inch. You'll then want to install the left hand bracket using two of the four largest screws. And make sure they're snug down pretty tight, but do not over tighten. You can then open the front side of this bracket. You'll then want to take the blinds and place them in the bracket on the left hand side. Hold them up. Place the bracket on the right hand side and trace a line to make sure you don't push it over too far when you install it. Then using the line you just traced, you're going to take the right hand bracket, hold it up to the line, make it square front to back, left and right, and then trace the holes. Then using the drill again, drill them out to a depth of about one inch. Then install the bracket and tighten down the screws. There's then a pin with a tag on top that says remove before installing. Make sure you remove that pin. Install the twist rod by inserting it into the hole until you hear a click. Then to install the valance, you need to take the two white clips, slide them down the channels, one on each side, and you want to position them about a third of the way in on each side. Take the valance and clip it onto the top of the blinds themselves. Right over the top, they kind of cl clip in and hook down. You're then ready to install the blinds themselves. I start by having the left bracket open and the right one closed. This kind of helps because you can put one side in without worrying about it slipping out. So I put the right side in. And then on the left, you kind of slide it in. And as you're sliding it in, you want to close the door on the bracket itself until it clicks. And that's it. You've installed it. Now you'll just want to double check the range of motion, go up and down, make sure the blinds work correctly, and you're good to go. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If this video helped out, please give it a huge thumbs up and consider subscribing. And we'll see you in the next one.